My name's Topher. I'm a Christian conservative hip hop artist. I've got multiple Billboard songs. Uh, everything I do has been independent. You know, the founder and the leader of the new federal state of China, Mr. Mao Guo, he's CCP's enemy number one, and he loves music. And the most popular song that he sang is "Take Down the CCP and Fight for Hong Kong." How does that sound to you? It sounds like we should do a remix. To me, that's just, that's the easiest way for a lot of people across the world to join a fight is through music, because they say music transcends language. So why you're using the music to take down the communist dictatorship? So I served in the military here, and so I know a little bit about fighting for freedom, fighting for the Constitution, and I think that's what makes America one of the greatest countries in the world is because we have so much freedom to do so. And when I see on the TV screen, when I look at some of the news outlets, and I see a lot of the fighters over there in Hong Kong and with the American flag, I'm like, wow, this is awesome. A lot of times they understand what we are fighting for and what it represents more than some of our own citizens. I just like supporting freedom. Evil is evil, no matter where it comes. We can all come together for the good to fight the evil, and that's what I see when I look across as far as the CCP and what they're doing. And one of the ways that we're trying to fight the CCP is through TikTok. Um, and what they show in the app compared to what they do in other countries, and it's weird that we're kind of sleeping to that. People have known for a long time that America can never be destroyed from the outside. It can only be destroyed from the inside, and that's what they're doing. They're slowly degrading our education, slowly degrading our will to fight, slowly degrading our worldview and everything else. So we become weak people, and they can come in and just take over. And that's why I want to see, because like you said, I have two daughters. When I fight, I want to make sure that they don't have to pick up the sword when they get my age, and they also can be proud of their dad. That when something was going wrong, yeah. I was the example that showed them, hey, you got to speak up for it. So yeah. that's why we got to fight. I mean, we're all in this together. Today's Hong Kong, today's China will be tomorrow's America. What do you think about that? I think that will resonate with a lot of people across the world, and and to know that this is not just a Hong Kong problem. It's, this is an America problem, and, and most of all, this is a free world problem. We have to fight, and we have to stand with one another. Take down the CCP right now.